Because we ready to rock and roll. We're ready. ACDC. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode. Baby, you know what this is. If you don't know what this is, what you doing here? What you doing? But even then, I'm going to tell you what this is. Don't leave. Don't go nowhere. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Shit. Why the fuck? God I'm damn it. Scrolling and pay attention. Right. This is the Smoke For Me, the podcast. This is some shit you want to pay attention to. This is episode number. Wait a minute. See? I got that 120 now. See, you ain't supposed to do that, Mike. Yeah, he's supposed, supposed to let him fumble, that. Mike. Yeah, I ain't even supposed, supposed to let him know. fumble. He tried to do it quiet. You on still, camera, nigga. 106. <laughs> this is 106. Why the fuck I want to say 120 something, guys, yeah, This is everything. Yeah, you on camera. What the fuck you doing? Yeah. What the fuck are you doing? Say, right, so you snitching. Somebody snitching on me. Nah. Right in front of that. That thing record every time. Right. That motherfucker Red light worked, is definitely man. blinking okay. on that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Episode number 106, 106. Smoke for Me, the podcast. We appreciate y'all fucking with us another you. time. You know what? What? We got to start not cussing for like 10 minutes into the thing. I think we need a few more people to share this person. You think so? we not worry about it. Hey, right now, we could still go hell. Fuck that shit, then, Fuck bitch. Fuck that shit. God damn Fuck it. Fuck that bitch. 15 seconds or Fuck something. Don't really. Hey, oh. that's on my playlist. Okay, then. All right, I'm just saying. Young Joe. I'm clean. My kids probably know the words. Oh. They don't say them, but they probably okay. don't. Okay, they say it when you ain't there. Hey, one time, Auto, Auto did let a word flip. Man, she was back I, in the back seat. I, she was gone. And she, oh. yeah. <laughs> I said, okay, maybe I, all right. I, lesson learned, lesson Welcome learned. Welcome back. Um, in 256 788 Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Like, comment, subscribe, share, share the, click the notification bell, yep. tell somebody about it, tell us about it, communicate, contact tell us. us. About this shit. Love it. Yeah. If you don't Do like it. this shit, Nah, keep that part to yourself. Nah, you tell us that shit, too. I don't, I don't care. I don't want to hear you, this shit. If I, you fuck with I'll this shit, it. tell us about this shit. I'll read it. I ain't saying I'm going to like you as a person for it. But I'll read it, though, if you leave it there for me to read. You know what I'm saying? So, welcome back. This is Smoke Permitted Podcast. We I'll appreciate you joining it. us again. Tell um, who he is. I'm is Bob Jacquez. I'll read it. Yep. Tell him who is. He is the Honorable Reverend Cato it's Jackson. It's me, goddamn. Oh, tell him who he is right now. Right there, that is the one and only Off White Mike. Off White Mike in this motherfucker. We in this motherfucker, man. Hell yeah. Appreciate y'all fucking with us. I said that already. I appreciate okay. the fuck out of it, though. Yeah, appreciate it. Damn, Pro Shades. Put the blunt on the microphone. Why? You gonna drop hey, the cherry on the polo? I am. I mean, and then the comfortable jeans? Hey, all of them comfortable now. Now they are. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Man, the hell is talking your shit, then, nigga? What that little bitch? I don't even know what the mother was saying. Yeah, I don't even remember how this shit feel when you got regular jeans. Yeah. No, 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 no. These is regular jeans. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's regular now. Shit. I'm cleaning this bitch. Oh, let me stop my shit. And I got comfortable jeans in this Aye. bitch. Hey. Hey. Carbon 15 Aye. in this bitch. Don't you probably drive. got one of those in here, too. I don't got no carbon 15. They jam a lot. I don't know. You I had one before? I don't like Project Guns. Okay. I'm just saying. No Project Bitches, <laughs> no Project, no project bitches, Guns. No Project Guns. He's just none, no, nothing from your past. No, because you once you make it out of there, see, that's how you could tell. None of you don't like, want the candy really, lady, like the good candy lady house that don't steal from you or nothing. No, because you know where she bought that shit from? That's though. Sam's. I got go Yeah, there. but I don't got a membership. You I got, got go, one? No, but I know somebody. We need to get one do. for. We gonna get we could, one. Yeah. And we gonna go in that bitch one time, and we gonna pay on that membership for, for twelve months. Yeah. <laughs> twelve we months. We not gonna get one. Hey, if you got a Sam mm-hmm. membership, and we could go with you, two Holla five six seven eight eight seven three three nine. Come on, follow. Smokers at gmail If you got some food stamps, yeah. even better. We ain't gonna mm. buy them because that's illegal. Yeah, goddamn. I'm about to say we're not gonna like, buy them, but we can barter for a dollar. Yeah. <laughs> finish it all I didn't finish it all, all, all You know who you talk to Oh shit That's the only way I'm talking to you <laughs> You might could've Got a better deal See Nah it don't get No better than Finish it on the dollar You don't know Who you talking to Finish it on the dollar You don't know Who you talking to You should just Buy right. some cracks You Alright See he ain't there No money Some of them get them Don't need them That little $300 Of food stamps Some of them They be like yeah Hey that's a good cook hat Yeah She alright we be on some more shit. How your week been, man? Uh, What's been going on this week, man? My week. My week. Let me talk to the mic. Um, it was all right. It was weird. It was interesting and weird. Um, some stuff happened at work. 
I ended up getting off of work way earlier, like the whole week, than I usually do. So that okay, was then. odd. I had to figure out what to do with some extra time. And a nigga. Because I don't like now. take naps. And yeah, now so I don't see. Don't I don't even know. How, now. Yeah. Shit, all right. So I was like, okay, cause I'm cool with the short yeah, days. Okay, I was like, nah, dude, my motherfucking hours got there. Yeah, <laughs> well, nah, fuck them hours now. <laughs> yeah, fuck them now. So, um, yeah, that happened. Uh, it was happy birthday, Alex. It was my sister's birthday. Happy birthday, Alex. Yesterday, yeah. uh, the day before yesterday, like, I mean. What did them over call me? Easter basket? <laughs> yeah, Easter basket. Yeah, I'm taking my happy birthday back. Nah, but fuck that. I like Easter basket. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> I do like Easter basket. Easter basket yep. be clean as hell. Yeah, my daughter's birthday coming up next weekend. Okay, then happy birthday. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm hell yeah. Um, what else happened? I, don't I feel know. like something happened, but. No, I don't remember. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that was my week, guys. Thanks for joining me for it. All right, How was your week? Up, some birthdays and shit. What I do this week? Um, So, most of my week, most of all the time, it'd be like mundane, plain Jane week. Mm -hmm. But one day out of the week, shit just happens sometimes. I don't know if it'd be me that day. Mm -hmm. Like, if I just be on some more shit today, or if it shit just be happening like that that day. So, okay. Uh-oh. No, so I met the gas pump. I'm pumping gas in the work car. That's how you go places. Where the fuck am I? I'm in Chattanooga. Okay. I'm pumping gas and shit. Some bitches pull up. I met like a hood store. I know like a little, like, yeah, I'm going to stop at the hood store. Okay. I'm going to stop at the store, shit. Some bitches pull up and shit. They jump out. There's like four bitches in the car. Music up real loud and shit. We understand, okay. like it's kind of chilly. Was anybody like, twerking on the headlights? They didn't twerk on the headlights. Nah. They didn't twerk. Two on went in the stove, two on stayed in the car. Okay. Pumping gas. And I hit one from behind me. Hey! You hit one from behind? I hear one from behind me. Oh, I thought it was hear story. One I thought we were going somewhere me. here. No, no. Okay, well. There's a lot of shit you gotta skip to keep them. <laughs> I, mean, hey, I was yeah, just pumping gas would, and then yeah, fucking. Bye bye. <laughs> shit. Cool with me if it's cool with you. Cool with me if it's cool with you. But no, so I hear something from behind me say, hey! Pay no attention. I figure they talking to the other bitches in the car with them. Like right. Hey, you. You hear me? I just been... <laughs> you talking to me. I ain't, I ain't know you I don't talking like you to hear me. me. I, I, I don't you, like yeah, that. No, I told you bitches is aggressive as fuck now, goddamn. I don't like that. But it was more of a question, like, for real. It wasn't real aggressive. Yeah, but, yeah. It's like, oh, yeah, I ain't know you was talking to me. What's, what's going on? You kind of cute. Oh, okay, I appreciate it. That's, what's up. That's a nice car, too. Yeah, I appreciate it. That's what's up. Yeah, that's, that's cool. What y'all finna get into? Oh, no, nah, what you finna get into? Nah, like, nah, yeah, nah, I'm finna go meet up with my wife and shit. Yeah, then we finna go out and shit. <laughs> I'm a Chattanooga guy. I don't know nobody here. But bitch, you too aggressive. Leave me alone. I haven't even heard you say wife. Shit, we finna go meet up and have some food right now, y'all. Yeah, <laughs> but shit, you lying? Say, bitch, how you know? Because the bitch caught me off guard. Yeah, I ain't know. Like, bitch, lying. how you know, God damn it? It's like, you gay. Like, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> like, like, what? She's like, you don't want none of us. Like, nah, like, nigga, you must be gay. Like, all right, bitch. And yeah, I ain't know what to say no more. For real. Yeah, okay. Like, bitch, I'm not gay. I just don't Since like you. Since you been on the road, you been a gay capper. That's some bullshit. <laughs> just, hey, ladies, I don't give a fuck what you look like or what the fuck you think you look like. <laughs> Every nigga that don't want you is not motherfucking gay. Just don't want you aggressive bitches. Damn. My yeah, he don't like gay. aggressive. He don't like aggressive people. Kind of shit is it? He doesn't he, appreciate that's, that's that energy. That's how aggressive the bitch is. The, to my face, right here. She was the the bitch said you gay. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't this close. She was by her car. She was at the hall. She wasn't that tall. <laughs> All right, because that's intimidating. You can't. <laughs> but she was looking at me bitch. when she said it. God damn it. She was looking at me but when she said it. But it's if it's coming from a little bitch, and if it's coming from a bitch, this. It's taller. What did what are you six three six two? I'm six? not dead, goddamn tall. I'm like taller. six one for real. Okay. Well, you don't look it. So, what? I'm give you I'm six look, two. Oh, okay, maybe six, so. Three. I don't know. I don't know if you know. Actually, I don't really think I go by your word on your. The house. doctor told me they got the little thing. Hey, <laughs> how did how did you it work? Know how this go? Okay. <laughs> <That's what's up. laughs> so, Damn. later that day, I pull up at another store. Some, grab me a little snack or something, God damn. Grab me some shells too. Yeah. Now that, that's where the problem came in with the Swiss of sweets, the Swiss of dime. These motherfuckers right here, these right here. So it's a store, it's a cashier on this side. It's an automatic checkout thing on this side. You know, right. you just put your shit in circle there. Circle K. And it's circle K. 
they just bought all the map codes too, goddamn. Oh damn. Yeah, all the Oh them. yeah, I yeah. seen all the folks about their points mad about that shit. <laughs> it's over with. Better get the That's wild code though, points. right? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, shit. That's fucked up. Shit. I'd be mad if I had Class all the points. Too, goddamn. Can you? I don't know. I bet you can. I want my points back. You can't be nah. So I'm yeah, glad they I don't have nothing. Yeah, them motherfuckers gone. Bankrupt baby. But Go yeah, ahead. um Cash you on this I'm, side. And it was self checkout on this side. I'm waiting in line. It's it's two people in line right here. It's the lady sitting down. It's the older black lady sitting down right there doing. In line? It. No, she doing the <laughs> she the cashier. Oh. It's like two people in line. I'm waiting, goddamn. We get up there, yeah. She had me what I want, and I told her, well, had this shit right here, goddamn. Let me get some swisher. She said, Oh, you could have did this at the self checkout. Oh shit, you, I'm nice as fuck. She got an attitude right now, but I'm still I'm nice as fuck, and nice. it's the old black lady. Okay. I'm sorry. I ain't even know I could do that. I ain't know I could buy tobacco. Oh, yeah. You could buy anything over there. Okay. Yeah. Now nah, I know that. Yeah. You know it because I told you. Hey. All right. I mean, All right. right. Yeah. I wouldn't have known it if you wouldn't have told me. I'm still like, yeah. Okay. All right. Now, now what else you want? You want something else? You know what, old bitch? Oh. I don't even think I want this shit what? I got. <laughs> And that ain't me. That ain't my character. Like, it's an old lady. I don't I like just, them. See, this is what I want to I don't want like them, but I'm not going to talk crazy Cause, to the old lady. But Because now, now I'm remembering something. that I had a moment with an old person, too, something like this. I this told week, you. And I didn't, I didn't think about this, old but I be bullshit. trying to keep some of these opinions to myself. And I, I, I don't subscribe to the respect me because I'm old. I, I, I do until you disrespect me. Like if you old, I'm I'm gonna show you the utmost respect. You done seen some shit I ain't seen. But the moment I see Says who? you got I'm I'm sure you have. You you done been around longer than me. You, you done seen been high the whole time. Seen. You could have been high. I've been high the whole time too, so we even no, not, not that kind of high. <laughs> You're right, but I, I know they seen some zombie. shit I ain't seen. Maybe. I mean. Maybe, but every stranger could could have that. But yeah, I, claim. I try I, I try to be respectful to most people. I don't I don't subscribe to that. I subscribe to we are even, we are fucking humans. Yeah. And it don't you matter be what your age is. You respectful me as well, though, yeah. And I, I had a moment. I, I went to a place. My my kids have been telling me about it for a little while. Um, I'm trying to, you know, do the cordial right thing and co-parent correctly. Okay. So, I so can we, imagine we, that shit get hard. We spent some uh, family time. And uh, so we uh, go. Oh, uh, y'all? Yeah. <laughs> I, I did have a bit of a week. But <laughs> we're not going to get into it. Hey, shit, this week, y'all. All right. So. We go to this place. I'm not going down the place. And I'm not going to talk too much shit about the place because I feel like people Fuck from here, place. especially black people, are going to know exactly what I'm talking about if I describe it in any way. So I'll only talk I about the part that, I, I that I'm that sharing this, this moment with you at. Um, right. There was an option to go to what they referred to as an omelet bar. Um, okay. You could also get some waffles there, too. Uh, the omelet person, bar, that sound weird. But I ain't my, Okay, cool. Right, so you already I, agreeing I, with I, me all real. Because I ain't. All right, all right. So, but the person working the bar, there was two, there were two black men, older black gentlemen back behind us. This nigga's making my omelet too? Oh, hell no. Nah. I don't want no parts of this omelet. I was I was cool. I was, Fuck you know, that. I'm, not gonna, I'm not going, I'm not going, I'm a chill. I'm chilling, right? Where the muffins at? I'm chilling. But then I heard my man open his mouth and say something, and the way he said it, I was immediately not chilling no more. No, I see, felt I the inside knew, yeah. of me start boiling, and I was like, you know what? I'm probably gonna be cool on these omelets. It's like I'm just gonna go back in there and eat some chicken. Come, come away from this omelet. I had to look, and then so this is what happened. This is why the, I really realized how much I stand on this. Cause like fuck, fuck your age. Fuck you if you just an asshole. You oh, yeah, if you an asshole, fuck you. I had to go back. Pause. <laughs> I guess. If you want to. So. No, resume. Um, I had to go you back. You got to start that back? I had to go back no, to the shit. goddamn, uh, to the fucking omelet bar, because my son wanted some fucking waffles. And he had been in there wilding already. Like, now I realize, too, that I need to take them more places. I be... I be too rec- I be reclusive too much. Man, okay. The way he was acting in there, the both of them, I was, bruh, I can't even. Cause then I'm gonna get the place. What? I mean, so I go back. I go back, and and the man, 
had the, the hat that was talking shit anyway to other people. I hear that talking shit. He, he did, oh, he. I'm telling you, as soon as he said something, I was ready to. I had to, I had to remove myself from the situation. I left. I left the omni bar as soon as he started talking. You shouldn't like, be you fucking threatening that so the omni bar. I go back. I go back. It's supposed to be peaceful. And he's as gonna fuck. ask me why I didn't ask for this the first time I was up here with my lady friend. What's your lady friend? <laughs> this nigga seventy three. I told omnibar? you it's an elderly black man, but he gonna ask me why I did. Bitch, because I ain't wanted that. Bitch, see, I wanted that. See, I was trying to not do Omnibar that, ass and I nigga. realized, like, old people. Hey, hey, see, see, the old people for the baby. Man, I had a okay. flashback to the gas station when, my, when I had to goddamn. Man, okay. Remove myself from that situation. Oh, okay, that's what you did. Yeah. When well, you pushed that old man down. <laughs> you talking about when you pushed that old man down? I ain't pushed nobody down. Oh, okay. I ain't pushed nobody down. I removed somebody from my physical space. <laughs> somebody decided they should be closer to me than I felt was comfortable okay. for my safety. I ain't so blame, I I don't blame you for space. pushing that old man down. I, I ain't pushed push the old nobody man down. down, too. I ain't pushed nobody down. Push the old man down, gay. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, yeah, yay. Yeah. <laughs> you fuck from 65 to 95. Fuck you your fake hips. You still alive, bitch. I'm going to push you down and break both of your thighs. <laughs> fuck your fake hips <laughs> on the set, nigga. You going to jail. I'm not with him. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. You going to jail. I'm white, white. What your yes, week sir. was like, man? What you do this week? I ain't do much, man. I just chill for real, man. I ain't, I ain't do much, man. Just trying to gather myself before I get back in it. Um, oh, yeah, you I went and seen a movie. Smoke. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I go back to school. <laughs> went and seen a movie, though. Went seen, okay, uh, what you went to see? That Shit. new Avengers movie. The Avengers? Oh, okay, yeah, man. Oh, well, oh, the Marvels. Marvels. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. I tried to find it on my free website. Yeah. I started watching it. Who but won? I didn't finish it. I I'm wait till a better free version <laughs> come out. Yeah. Now, you know, we can't go into details. You know, they get mad out there. Oh, you're going to spoil it. Spoil yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I, shit, the motherfucker in the blue one, I seen it too. <laughs> the motherfucker in the blue. <laughs> but yeah, nah, did nothing did that, um, significant happen. You know what I'm saying? Good, peaceful week. So uh, I ain't really got much on this week. You know what I, I mean? Right. Just, uh, just just recharging, uh, re energizing for, for, the, for the new week. Yeah, yeah, that's always good. Peaceful weeks and shit. Yeah. I yeah, that's that's word. Mine would have been peaceful. That bitch wouldn't have called me gay. Yeah. Bitch, yeah, that is a little gay. fucked up. It's all the way fucked up. Yeah, a little fucked did, up. Did you feel why. uncomfortable? Like, it made you feel uncomfortable when she was that aggressive or what? No, it, no, I just, I don't feel uncomfortable. I just don't want this shit around me for real. Yeah. Because I know them, them, the, them the bitches. If you, no, if you say the wrong, I guess so. Because if you say the wrong thing to them. Then you gay or some shit. Yeah, or you gotta fight. Yeah, yeah I was gonna fight. say you got yeah. it's popping off. It's popping yeah. off. Like, like, and they about to call yourself. all the dudes right, yeah. they know. I shouldn't be threatened <laughs> by the pussy. Like I shoot you bitches. Uh, Leave me alone. Exactly. Like how the fuck does that work when you police pull up? Like you shot three bitches trying to fight. Like, <laughs> like, what? Like the bitch yeah. tried to jump he must, on me. He must have been defense. gay. You don't know. <clears throat> he must have been gay. Then shot. I'm gonna be gay. Yeah. Hey, but these bitches trying to jump on me, girl. <laughs> I sure thing. I pulled, ass. I pulled my gun out. I ain't man, know what when? to do. Man, pew when? pew on the ass. I sure <laughs> thing. <they> ass. <laughs> It's oh, fucked up. Shit. It's <laughs> fucked up. Damn. I'm afraid it may be gay. So, um, I guess we got some bad news, some sad news. Yeah. Bring it down a little bit. Yeah. Some awful shit going on. Yeah. So, I don't know if y'all remember. It's unfortunate. The Montgomery brawl. When them motherfuckers got to fighting with them folks. When them black folks got to fight with them white folks, I guess that yeah. should be more descriptive because a lot of people got to fight. You said the motherfucker got to fight with the folks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was pretty general. <laughs> in Montgomery, though, we know that much already. Yeah, I'm, you saw I'm the, the folding chairs shit. on social media. Yeah, the somebody dude, was a folding chair for Halloween. The dude that threw the hat in the air, the co-captain of the ship, has been charged with is the second degree assault, third degree assault, third degree assault. And I think that's some bullshit. It is definitely. I some think bullshit. they need to let co captain go, and I think we need to start a motherfucking uh, a free co captain till it's backwards. A fuck, I, a, that's gonna be the name of the website that we need to start. We free need to start a goddamn nonprofit for co captain because they yeah. playing with him. 
And we need to get him some more hats. Um, he was the one that got whipped the most out there. He looked like he wears slides and loafers. At the same time. Yeah, one on each foot. Um, I think, yeah, I don't understand how he getting charged with shit. That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. Like, in the report of, the, of him being charged, the video clip that they show shows him getting attacked, and they can Third degree on. assault. Yeah. Don't I don't even bit. know what that is. What this, is I mean, I don't have, I've never had any It's the bottom charges. of it. Like, you got first, second, and third. Yeah, but what do you, is that like if you spit on somebody that's third degree? That's assault? what they feel like for real. Because I'm third degree, feel like, bitch, why y'all playing with me for real? Yeah, like, you threw, <laughs> like, either goddamn, like what you, you going to do with bitch, go and leave me long, goddamn it. You threw a purse at somebody or something? And I don't know. What, like a, I don't know how that shit works. But third degree, is, it feel like it's, it's very minimum assault going on. Or you getting assaulted, maybe. Yeah, it sound like you lost. <laughs> yeah. I feel like he definitely lost and in his third did. degree, goddamn. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He was the only nigga out there that got beat up for real. And he the one that got them that got That's charged. Wild. That's fucked up. The chair nigga know, ain't even get no the chair nigga did get charged. They better not fire him. If they fire him, hey, listen, I don't if you watching this, turn it down because everybody don't need to hear this. But um, if they fire you. Go on in people's boat, because you, you, you the co-cabin. You know how to drive that bitch. Drive yeah. that bitch to where it's real deep and put a hole in that bitch and fuck them people's boat. just put a hole in on it? On my mama How now. you just put a hole in the he boat? Know, he the captain of this bitch. Yeah. I don't know how to do they it. They didn't teach him how to destroy the boat. But they he know. How to he know, though. Use it. He know. Pull the plug out that bitch. Yeah, the stopper at the bottom. Yeah, <laughs> pull that bitch out like a bad tub. All the water come in that bitch. Yeah. Not the boat stopper. Yeah, for the boat stopper. But bring you another ride, though. Bring you another ride. Don't fuck around and just <laughs> sink that bitch and you ain't got no way back. Oh. But yeah, if they yeah, find you. Their story, your story going to be that you went down with the boat on purpose. Yeah, that's suicide by boat. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah. If they fire you, you, you sink that boat. But don't tell them we told you. Matter of fact, because this shit is they for fire him, they gonna take all the keys only. and shit. He don't be able to get on the boat. Nigga, you gonna, gonna make sign. a copy? You don't make a copy of your keys at work? Your boat keys? Shit, all the keys. All right. No. <laughs> shit, I'm coming back. <laughs> no, I don't got no copy of my work key truck. I'm coming I mean, back. My work truck key. I got 37 copy car, uh, car keys. <laughs> Yeah, no, I ain't. Yeah, I say no. the scat pack keys. No, I don't have some keys too. I tell you, I tell you what, I don't have some keys to some places, boy. No, see, use them bitches. No, nigga, you ain't breaking in. Cause then them places are gonna have you needing some keys. <laughs> you go, go ahead and do that shit if you want. Don't to. Don't do that shit. Cause yeah. you're going to jail. You're yeah, right. You're going to prison you're for a long jail. time. I'm not going because this for entertainment purposes only. I feel you. The thought has, you know, <laughs> the thought did come across my mind. A you got to do something, though. Shit, no. Yeah, yeah, they can't yeah. fire you. You need to be fucking captain. Fuck this co-captain shit. Right. You will fight for this shit. Nah, I bet them other motherfuckers won't fight for this shit. He fought because he was getting beat up. He could have got out of there, though. He didn't even fight. He got beat up. He could have got out of there, though. Like, he's, he stood there squared up and shit. Like, he could have got out of there. Nah, for dude him. rushed him. Remember the dude came nah, off the with head and shit. Punch. Like, he was yeah. standing there and threw the head and then like it was go time. He could have got out of there before that. No, nah, he was back up. No, he, was, he was ready for that bullshit, too. You got to be. I mean, you're He right. was just doing his job, though. You like right you about said, that shit, too. He just doing his job. You, they, they, he got beat up. I don't know how the fuck I, I don't turned know how you into plan on in the getting battle. out of there with four dudes around. Maybe he couldn't have got out this. of there. If you, you were captain on the boat, carry a pistol. Who? Quick. Yeah. To shoot a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Now I changed up. All right. <laughs> I'm just saying. I got outrun that girl. Mama got me. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Especially shoot them. Man, okay. <laughs> But that's some bullshit. Uh, free, free cap, goddamn it. Uh, Late some hoes for this shit. I realized why I missed the TV halfway through that, too. Why oh, you missed the TV? Yeah, we didn't have it. We got to put it back up because we don't see the time anymore. We don't know how long we've been doing this shit no more. We're going to get a time and put it up there yeah. like the professionals. Yeah, I, can't, I can't see whatever the fuck that say on that camera. Ain't it? 30 minutes, see? 30 minutes. Told you. Oh. See? I could feel it, though. I was, my internal clock had told me. That's what's up. It was like 29.37. It actually was. See? Yeah. See? I be yeah. knowing. Yeah. All right. You got it. This shit ain't real. It's a simulation. Simulation. Not simulation. No, Simu sim simulation. Simulate, like simulate. Yeah, simulation. simulation. That's what this shit is. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, that's what this shit is. 
S I M A Lation. Simulation. <laughs> Shit. What we what we going to, man? What you gonna what you gonna go to next? What else no? What's on that motherfucker? Shit. Cause 40, now we gotta get gone. Cause now 40, we're 30 minutes. Forty two million dollars. Forty two. That's not no, what it's not what that's it's saying. not what it's saying at all. <laughs> it's so one million woman. dollars. You can uh, find her name. You got it. There's a woman who who was a teacher. And, uh, wow, I'm sorry. I interrupted you. But these notes, Bob, they say 42, one million. Two, one million. 42 See, to one million. 42 to one million only lost. fans. It's, I'm sorry. It's a note. I Shorthand. That's why I told you to find that. You right. So you will have it and you and can I have the details. You right. I said 42 men and was yeah, wrong as fuck. You skipped the dash in? I, I should have 42 yeah. dash. One million. million. <laughs> yeah, you yeah, read it right. <laughs> you right. <laughs> I'm sorry. Read it rightly. So, the Missouri teacher, at least she used to be a Missouri teacher, they found out she had an OnlyFans. And they was like, nah, bitch. She did used to be a teacher can't because do this they shit found here. out. You out of here? What's her name? Brianna Kopich. Brianna was making uh forty two thousand dollars a year as a teacher. Yeah. Um, I forget if it said what grade or whatever. It said what teaching. grade she was. Um, it don't say what grade. I can't. She yeah, was. I can't remember. We said middle school, elementary school, but she was making forty two thousand a year as a teacher. It was a um, high school. Oh. Yeah, all them little boys. No, she's been, been a teacher there. for five years, and she's been the last two. It's St. Clair High School as an English teacher. Okay, an English teacher. Yeah. So she on OnlyFans just teaching English. St. Clair, Missouri. Because she got on OnlyFans, and in six months, That's she true, made a million dollars. Off of predicates and adverbs and, and adjectives, adjectives and shit. And nouns, proper nouns, pronouns. No pussy. Uh, that's a that's a noun. Oh, okay, that, that is a person, place, and thing. That is a person, place, and thing. And there are adjectives that can happen with with that noun. You can describe their pussy. Mm -hmm. There are adverbs that can happen with the noun. You can do something to their pussy. That's a verb. That's an action verb. That's a verb. Yeah. yeah. You can do something to their pussy. Yeah. I guess so, and that's why um, she made a million dollars. In six months. Because I'm sure it wasn't the English. Or just under six months. So sure. five years... What's, what's five times 42,000? All right. Alexa, what's five times 42,000? Five times 42,000 is $210,000. That's a lot of $1,000. That's, that's five years, $210,000, six months, $1 million. That's not a lot of $1,000. She quint, quintupled it? Damn near. Yeah, yeah. She, it's about she four quintupled yeah. it in six months. That's fucking crazy. But they got wind of it at the school no, somehow. Right. Somehow these teenage boys and these other uh, probably it was probably a, it was you probably know a it teacher. Was the fucking teacher. It's somebody it was parent. All the parents. All the parents. That's what I thought. Yeah, it was an angry wife. There's been a the couple of them. Yeah. She found out the, the dad. Probably. Yeah, that's yeah. what it was. Yeah, the dad was looking at Con the teacher. Yeah, ah, oh, that's such and such. Yeah, and yeah. then read it on the when he got. No, it was Jimmy teacher. <laughs> oh, it is. I didn't know the boy sent me this link. Man, what? Yeah, he tried to get up out of this shit. Damn. So now she's fired. <clears throat> What do you? I, I mean, we talked about this a couple times. How you? How you? Fuck that job you, though, shit. But for real though, I um. You changed your stance, your opinion. No, it's, fuck it's that job. Wild. Fuck no, the, I'm saying but her I don't getting want, fired because they found out that she does OnlyFans. For real though, I don't know. I, I'm judgmental than the motherfucker, and I know that. And <laughs> fuck it, it is what it is. But I don't want high school different. I don't want my elementary kids. To find out your pussy uh, is on the internet. If my kids see your pussy, they can't come to your class no more. That's fair. So I mean, yeah, I, if if the kids see it, then maybe they got to get rid of it. God damn it. I remember uh, when I was in Davis Hills. Uh, I ain't gonna say the teacher name, you but seen she, the pussy. she was in a Playboy. No, and they brought to school. No, but Crazy. back then things was different though. You know, she was Crazy. a math teacher. No. Yeah, but I remember they, yeah. they she ended up going home one day because they brought the book or something. She was crying and just don't yeah, be crying, she, man. You put that good? pussy out there, huh? Did she look good when she was a teacher? Uh, I, I would have stuck her. Or, or, okay, all right. You know, you know, in That's that sense, white Mike turn. 
Mitch Stuckle? <laughs> Man, I, I, I'm yeah. stuck. I took a second. It took me a quick little yeah, second. I, 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 was, yeah. I, had a, I, I had a heartbeat skip in my thought process right there, but I got you, though. I got you though. Yeah, you, you yeah. got a stuff. Right, she look good. Yeah, I want to stuck a two then, Mike. Man, what? She a playboy? Yeah. yeah. That's wild. Yeah. See, that's wild. Yeah, like no, I, so I can I can kind of understand. But you lose for respect real. for it. Uh, yeah. As for even I can remember back then, but I mean, I'm not she's still a person, a human being, but still. Yeah, yeah, yeah we Mitch, kids. You can't scold so you me, already man. know. Yeah. We was out the chain. It's middle school can't, too. Can Sit somebody down and shut up, bitch? I seen your pussy. Can somebody <laughs> whose pussy you seen have any job other than that that you won't like that you will respect them for? No, having? if I seen your pussy in, in, in a professional setting, <laughs> <laughs> that's the only thing I should see your pussy in. Uh, is a professional setting. <laughs> you shouldn't see them at all unless it's professional setting. They can't. They can't be I don't want to see you at Walmart. Well, Playboy, <laughs> Playboy book is a professional setting, though. Yeah, that's it's the thing. Still, if you've done that professionally, professional. then you can't have no other profession ever. No, no, you can. no I'm not saying no. Nah, nah, I'm nah. bullshitting, Definitely. but I don't want you. I don't even say I don't want you teaching my kids. You could teach my kids if you've done the shit. But a college if, teacher. If the kid, well, no, nah, fuck this shit. If you were college now, I don't, yeah, fuck that. Maybe even fuck, it, but seeing in high school or some shit. But yeah, I don't want my kids to have been seen they kid they teachers pussy before. I think that's weird. I think what if, if, if she's I'm in like high school, a, uh, what if I, she's like a juvenile lawyer? She's juvenile lawyer. Yeah, she a lawyer for juveniles. Mm-hmm. She, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. What did somebody tell you? This the mm. best one right here. She get the job done. You want your son to he get you full of business. He ain't gonna nobody gonna know what happened. Everything gonna be cool. <coughs> Is that mystic pussy two twenty two? He be like that. <laughs> You know who my lawyer is? Look. Inside <laughs> Fuck and out. It. Fuck it. Hey, the way. Fuck Inside it. and out. Fuck it. So there are professionals. I'm, I'm that hiring that one. For, right. Yeah, I just don't want. She's not like a I teacher. said, no, you could do the shit, but I, yeah, I not guess. Not a teacher, not a preacher. Just things that rhyme? Or? A teacher? I don't care nothing about that preacher shit. Okay. Um, Shit, I think just some a teacher, somebody who's molding. What if they just like a, a my, my child. for hire music teacher? Mm-mm. Like that's guitar the, I think that's the worst one. Okay, that's the worst one because you already kind of you ain't even a real teacher. For nah, they real, work at Guitar real. Center. Exactly, <laughs> you ain't even a real teacher for real. Uh, uh-uh, uh, fuck that. You gonna try hey. to get my kids on your channel? All right, I can uh-huh. see. I can see what you're saying. I mean, I, I don't, I don't know. I, I still, I, I have a stubbornness in me that wants to say like, just if we talking about technically, right is right, and if she doing whatever she doing in her free time. I feel like you she right. shouldn't be punished for that. Until my job. kids see her pussy. But I mean, that is the way of the world. You get arrested. Some places you work, if you get arrested and they find out about it, it's you're fired. over with for you. So I, you know, I get. Imagine you know, being but, in high school, seeing your teacher pussy, and you got to come back to school, and she tell you sit down, and shut up. Maybe not in those words, cause she a bitch if she do it. But still, yeah, I can't. I'm not, I, don't I don't respect know. this lady no more. How good she look? It don't even matter. That's all I'm thinking about now. <laughs> I might like it. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I might. Oh, okay. I might. She dominated. Okay, but now nah, I'm, I'm only in school. But she nah. can't tell me. She can't talk to me like that. Nah, regular. Fuck that. But in school, mm-hmm. I'm just gonna laugh because I don't see your pussy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You can't. You can't tell me shit, that. Okay. The whole time you talking to me, I, I'm looking at your. I'm, I'm visualizing your pussy, that. <laughs> <laughs> can't drop nothing. Man, okay. <laughs> Man, I see that before. Twelve ninety five. Still looking the same. Man, all right. Screen nah, recorded. Be fucked up. I'm in class. Like you need these thirteen dollars this month, don't you? You better give me. A, hey, you need these thirteen dollars this month. I don't know how OnlyFans break down. They pay out and shit like that. And I don't know if she took home a million or if she. What is it? Gross? Netted? I don't know. Whatever. Probably one. Just, I don't know. I but, hope she took home a million though. Fuck it. But congratulations on your money. <laughs> Fuck that school. I don't like school no way. Show that pussy. Now it's time for A-Bar. Show that pussy, man. (laughs) Hoes in the club, show that pussy. (laughs) Hoes at the school. Man, what? What you think? You think hoes at the school show that pussy song is good enough to get some Spotify world since that? (laughs) 
Maybe. You think so? Maybe. You know they changed it. You could get that. a thousand spins a year. I know they changed it that. Yeah, that's what it gotta it gotta have at least a thousand a year now. Oh, this it? Yeah, you gotta have if your song in playing at least a thousand spins per year, then they will demonetize your product. Oh hell. So all you gotta do is be trying for real. I said this shit like I know my songs ain't got a thousand plays. Yeah, I would say I don't know. I don't know. My sure. shit ain't got a thousand plays. Goes up yeah, every day. I mean. But um, <laughs> they finna demonetize my shit. What'd you say? I know how to get them plays up though, the right way. Yeah. yeah. Add your song to the Spotify playlist. Spotify playlist. Yeah, you, they got a free wheel. Like you can spend the wheel and put your song on there. I did get an email about the Spotify playlist. Shit, add your shit to the Spotify playlist. Spin the wheel. Get you some motherfucking spins and shit. Words of wisdom from Chevron Shop. Because if you ain't getting a thousand, you ain't getting a check. Yeah, you ain't getting a check no way with a thousand. Yeah, I mean, you, you're going to get, what you get, like, goddamn? It says $3. Oh, okay. It but, says $3. We don't know that to be before, actually before true. Taxes. We don't know what the splits are <laughs> of that $3. 33 cents. Yeah, like, but, but yeah, um. There's there's a lot of people that have very different like they, there's two extreme ends of opinions about this from what I've seen or heard. Some people uh, love it for reasons that could be justified, and some people. I don't, why hate would you it. love it? Give me a reason that could be justified. Why well, you? No, I think this is time for Off White Mike to join in. Okay then, all right. Why would people? Why why would you say that somebody? How do you feel about it? as somebody that is involved in music as you are? Um, <clears throat> I don't think a thousand streams is a lot asking for a lot. Yeah, Honestly. I don't think so either. I yeah. mean, if you think about it, it's not a lot. I mean, even if you somebody stream you once a day for 30 days or whatever, or even twice, you know what I'm saying? You'll have enough uh, to get the check, you know what I'm saying? So To get your $3 um, cut. But I, I mean, they, they're doing a whole lot of things. I think they put other things in places too, like so they keep people, like people will put static on there and get have people play the static and they get money oh, yeah, from the all sleep that stuff. So, so all this stuff. No, I'm just talking about not, not necessarily that. Just just putting uh, fake stuff up there, so they they're, they're controlling oh, yeah. more of that stuff and then more of the bots. And is it you know saying is it real or how is it coming to? So I, I think like just separating that stuff. To, yeah, all that stuff. So I think they're cracking down on that too. So well, if, but if it's a streaming farm that's playing the shit, isn't it gonna get more? Than, isn't it gonna get more than a thousand? That's what I'm saying. I, that's why I believe in. in Chevy could chime in too, or if he had anything on it. I don't think a thousand is asking a lot just to get paid. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, like, technically, I, I don't think it's a lot, really. If, like, like you said, if you really even just pushing it, yeah, that's if you do what you're supposed to be if doing, you try for real, you gonna yeah, get so they're making a statement doing. about demonetizing people who ain't making no money anyway. I mean, pretty much. But at the same time, I feel like why though, for real? Like, if these motherfuckers still, even if it's fucking. 700 views a month, God damn it. They still bringing that much traffic to your site, God damn it. Yeah, it's got to be benefiting you some, hell. Why I the fuck just I take the shit away is. from I, It would make sense, and I, I could see why people would be mad, but it would make sense to me why they do that, because you cut, you trimming off the fat. It's like going to a fast food place, and they'd be like, nah, only give them two napkins. So what happens? Type shit. But you'd be like, you a fucking conglomeration. You so could give me more napkins than that. What but, happens if your shit demonetized? Because you ain't been getting a thousand streams or whatever. Then you got to get your shit up. You know what I'm saying? but And somebody fucking tweet your shit tonight. Yeah, it's and, so viral. and your shit get fucking a million streams tomorrow. Then you qualify. But yeah, but now you got to get re-fucking monetized or some shit. Because mm -hmm. you deep. So all that shit didn't even count for real. Not till then. No. Yeah, see, that's some bullshit for real. It just got to be undeniable. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like all that shit probably ain't going to count for real. What you mean, the, like, you like, won't get your back pay from your streams? Yeah, that, like, no, you monetize up? from this point forward, so... You could probably fight for that, views but... views from here forward but is what you're going to get paid you for. You could probably fight for that, but the fact, the the amount of people that use one of the um, the websites, like a, a tune core or some shit like that, to a distribute... Uh, yeah, to distribute their music across Kato a Jackson, bunch of DSPs. Grind time. Not the time you do our stream platform. Um, they they do have a merch section now. 
Okay, then. I do have a merch section now, and they Save they went back and forth for that too, forward. where they was where they for a little bit they took it out to where artists couldn't count because time like the way things were happening when artists would go on tour and stuff like that, or before when they release a project, they would have they would have some like where you could buy a shirt, you could buy merchandise. And it would count as a sale because they send you the product too, as far as their music. And then they tried to stop that and take that out for a while, but then they brought it back again recently. But there is now a tab on Spotify that you can go and click on, and you can get merch from artists that offer that shit or whatever. But it, as far as the amount of people who don't really have a bunch of streams and aren't really doing shit, but using the platform. And the way that all the cut, all the money's broken down, <laughs> I, I was, all the money that's broken there, down yeah. and shit, I could understand from a business standpoint how Spotify will, why they want to do something like this because I guess from the bit, yeah, you, it's less you work just, for you, motherfuckers you, you that, you, that really ain't doing shit. I would assume you saving stuff because you using a platform that costs a lot of money to keep it going to pay all the distribution people that they have deals with or whatever talking with or however that shit gets handled behind the scenes and we don't know nothing about but my pay grade but at some point you could see hey if we do this we'll save this much money and that's just what it looks like to me it seems like the most obvious thing it don't really seem like nothing to fuss about because you wasn't making no money off this shit no way well yeah I guess that would have bought an answer you wasn't making no money anyway. they just told a bunch of motherfuckers who wasn't making no money that you ain't gonna make no money well, just think, mm-hmm. I, I think it's in the upper 10,000s a day. It's uploaded a day. Yeah. You're talking about 10,000 songs, so that's going to weed day. out a, a lot of, you know, well, yeah. you know, if they're you know, not doing it. But, <clears throat> yeah. But, I mean, if, you, if you're going to get your streams, you're going to get them anyway. So I don't think it's really going to affect the people who's doing it. Yeah, you're right. Anyway. I, I guess 1,000 streams ain't a lot of days. So I just wanted to argue about some shit because I'm probably drunk. It's eight, 83 <laughs> Point three three repeating uh, streams a month. So if you can get a little under a hundred streams, this is a thousand month. streams a year. Yeah, I thought it was a thousand streams a month. No, this is a thousand uh, streams a year. Everybody be out of there if it was a month. Yeah. Oh shit! You could do that to goddamn said, that's self. Why I said, yeah. You can't. They 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 didn't started doing stuff to try to. It's a little different, and yeah, they're trying yeah. to make it a little different. They're trying to control this. This the part that is a little bit scary about it is. They're starting to figure out ways to implement things that nobody saw coming and nobody else is going to have control over. Like, when it comes down to it, if it take you a certain amount of streams to make a certain amount of money, only certain artists on certain levels going to be able to do that. Everybody yeah. else just isn't going to get nothing from yeah. it. And you not being one of those artists means you have even less control or less say whenever there is a, tra- a chance to try to negotiate this or talk about yeah, it no, or yeah, do no. the type shit like the actors guild and no shit's streams. doing yeah. you can't you're not gonna be able to do none of this you and pay for Spotify these, yeah, no. you're just gonna see these two people with the power like we like we started the episode out wait for how many seconds we can't cuss blah blah, blah. like Man, wait. they got control over all this shit so and do you, all the DSPs and YouTube uh, they have been doing it right you gotta have a thousand subscribers so yeah. it's why Spotify yeah. just yeah. setting their entry level so to monetize so yeah. So y'all go subscribe. Two five six seven eight eight seven three three nine at smokers at gmail dot com. Click the subscribe button. No comment. Um, you don't gotta look at us when it happens. It don't matter. I'm gonna wear a t shirt like I always be doing. They gonna see us anyway. Worry about it. I'm gonna be cool. I'm gonna wear polo like I be doing. Yeah. You you know I'm not. Oh yeah. You hand on. Yeah. I already know. I already it. know. But I was gonna she. go with it for the people. Hell. All right. Um. Yeah. That's us. Talking about business stuff that we don't know nothing about. We don't know shit about this shit. But we know if you ain't getting no money on Spotify, you finna get no money on Spotify. Still. Congratulations. <laughs> but you don't gotta worry about like trying to get it because they got worry go about get it. it. Right. <laughs> okay. It ain't even because concern yourself with some more shit. Stop bogging down the system. Man, okay. Concern right. yourself. Get out the way. Yeah, way. You like those weeds that grow up by the house. Tuba movies. Damn. I'm just saying, make one of them bitches. All right. Or make the soundtrack for one of them bitches. Do that, too. Make both of them. In the game. The movie and the soundtrack. That's what we finna do. Smoking Permitted movie soundtrack coming soon. Oh. We making a hood movie? Nope. We're tucking our shirt in. 
Okay. And we both wearing glasses. Everybody wearing glasses. In the now I'm taking my, I'm getting contact. Everybody's wearing glasses. Going back to contact. Got to use your telephone voice and all this shit. Damn, son. Yeah. Both of y'all going to be in the new movie. Damn, son. Man, all right. Yeah. Y'all wait for this shit. I got to make too. my movie debut, Pine too. Woods. If I gotta make. Talk. I got to make my movie debut. Cause we finna do it. I'm telling you. We're going to be out here. You know what button I just pushed, right? Mm-mm. All right. Let's go. Uh, did you want to talk about the hood movie? I can't hear him no more. Shit, I guess we could have. Yeah, Boosie wanted to. Hell, yeah, we could too. What which one he said was the best one? It was between Menace to Menace Society, Society and Dead Boys Pre- in the, Was the Boys in the Hood? Uh, I thought it was Dead President. All right, so it don't even matter. We finna try it any fucking way. I was on silent. No, you wasn't. No, I you was. wasn't. See? I'm back didn't on. Even, I'm back on. Didn't even see what Boosie talking about in here. Here you go. Menace to Society is 10 times better. The boys in the hood. Mm. Ten times better. Mm. Not just a little better. Like, boys in the hood are fucking to a movie. That's what he said. What do you say? Shit, I, I think they, they bout. First off, they the same fucking movie. For real, for real. Like, it's not, but it is. It's the same fucking movie. Told from a different perspective. But I think they bout tip for tat for real. I think New Jack City a better movie than all them motherfuckers. Damn, it's like that? You be you on that old people shit. You mean no brain? What you mean, old people shit? That's you heard me? I'm, boys in the hood cool, too. I'm about to say, I think I like old dog enough Man, it's to, a society to with just because y'all got hair and shit. They don't no, make was, y'all cousins or nothing. I didn't say I was related to them. No. All right. But yeah, I, I feel like... And I Juice. don't know why Ricky ran straight. That was stupid as fuck. Stupid as hell. But why I, he had no pipe on Rick ain't gonna have no gun. Nah. Rick ain't gonna have no gun. He gonna have the football. I feel like Juice, Boys in the Hood, Minister you got Society. The juice now. It's all the same fucking movie for real. Pretty much. Paid and Fool. Paid is is a good fucking movie too. It's a great. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know if Tales from the Hood belongs in this argument. I don't think that counts in this category. All input is welcome, (laughs) Joe. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm. I think new. But I'm not really with none of them movies. Like, I I am barely in in the shotters. Those was really the two that I that I watched repeatedly. Yeah, Shadows was a good movie. Juice is my favorite. I didn't favorite watch none of those like on movie. purpose. If they if they was on TV, I'd watch them, but I didn't like go watch that you on purpose. Find them. Yeah, Juice is my favorite hood movie, but I still think New Jack City is a better fucking movie for real. New Jack City was a good movie. It was a good movie. And Wesley it's Snipes more this like shit. what a movie is supposed to. All the other movies is shit. Like if and you, I like the you, first quarter. If you grew up in the hood. You probably seen fucking Juice, Boys in the Hood, Minister Society, all this shit. You yeah. seen this shit firsthand for real. New Jack City is some movie shit. Motherfuckers ain't seen that for real. Like Nino Brown took over a whole motherfucking high rise building. Yeah. I ain't never seen nobody cook crack with their titties out. Right. That was amazing to me. That's some movie shit. That was a good scene. You see all the other shit growing up in the hood for real. This the only shit that's a real movie. Yeah, I'm, yeah, Belly takes all those. The shot is just over Belly. You said Belly takes all those. Mm-hmm. Belly better than all those? Yeah. Man, I don't want I don't I, Yo, Keisha. I don't, I don't know no don't fucking know, I Kiana. Know, I don't know that bitch neither. But you know what? The I it is kind of fucked up because old girl in the movie, I didn't realize like for a long time how young old girl was. He was like getting head from and on the phone with. Wasn't she like 16 or something? Yeah, shit? I don't just, ain't when I first saw it, like I was young too and it didn't, I didn't oh, yeah, nah, think I'm, about as soon it. As that, yeah, nah, <laughs> but as soon as they were like, yeah, that's that a teenager. Watching that picture of older, I'm like, oh. Yeah, you should go to jail oh, for that. How old was he? Jail. Yeah. Jail, yeah. jail. Yeah. yeah. Fucked up shit happened in all the movies, though. It did. It did. Ricky got killed. Yeah. It did. But shot is a... Tupac shot every fucking body. 
Yeah, that that movie. See, <laughs> that shit was just wild. Like you just that was that was stupid. It was, <laughs> but no, that shit could happen though. Yeah, it could. But, for real. But again, just for like, like you said, for a movie, like yeah. I was like, that's my favorite one. I yeah, watch I this shit over yeah. and over again. Yeah. I type this shit in every now and then to see if it's somewhere where I can watch mm-hmm. it for free now. I did. Uh uh-uh. uh. When they were standing on the porch and shot us, and he said, "Ooh, who killed my brother?" I like shouters. I like shouters. All of the, the bad bitch boys in the, in, the, in the pool, she what? was floating. Bad boys don't care. Yeah, take the what and lead yeah. the what. It's not like a pussy what. I think that's my favorite part of the book. That's my favorite. When the line. bitch got shot in the hot tub and she was floating with the fake titties. Bigs, you did too much now. <laughs> you you gone too far, Bigs. You gone too far now. You killed my bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker was saying about this bitch, goddamn it. Mad Max, crazy ass. Man, I ain't. Yeah. It yeah, still ain't better than New Jack City. I got a lot more reggae on my playlist, too. It still ain't better though. than New Jack City. It is. New Jack City, the greatest hill movie ever, in my opinion. It ain't It ain't the same category. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. The Carter? Yeah. That bitch jumped out, goddamn Wow. He did use some kids for shields. Is, that's the right movie, right? He yeah. used the kids for shields. Nino. Did he? I don't remember On the, the steps? Is that, am I, is that the right movie? I guess I'm blocking that out. <coughs> Payton Fool. Payton Fool was a good ass movie. Did, didn't Nino Brown use the kids for shields on the steps? I'm blocking that part out. Yeah. I don't remember that part. It's a whole lot of steps. That's fucked up. But shit, shit like that be happening to hell. Yeah, no, that was a good movie. Nino Brown wasn't a good guy. All right, I remember a little bit more of these movies than I thought I would. But yeah, which one y'all think is better? Menace to Society, Boys in the Hood. Because that was the original shit, I guess. I saw Boys in the Hood way more, so I I saw this shit a lot more. Menace to Society. But all this shit just felt like, for real. I like Boys this in the Hood, would, though, because This shit that, go on in this hood. This would, this, I, I felt like I was watching documentaries from another hood, for real. I like being able to see what it was like on a different place in yeah, the country and that's shit. that's what like, it felt like, for real. This yeah. is what the hood in L.A. like. And because, like, a lot of the stuff that I would see or pay attention to as far as entertainment-wise was a lot of East Coast and up North shit. So I already kind of seen that. And, of course, I already know what the South shit is. So being that South going side. that far to all the way to California, that might have just drawn me in a little more to to that movie. But I did just see it a lot more. Too. I feel like it was just on BT more and shit like that. Like, yeah, I don't. You can't. You can't make. You can't fucking pay me to watch a fucking hood movie with commercials in it. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking oh, and they ain't cussing neither. But you know, you Fuck just had this whole movie. On. You just be leaving the TV on on the channel, Fuck, like I'm, ESPN I'm or something. If, and then I feel bad if I do it, like nigga. You want them to get them ratings? No, I'm just saying if I if I'm watching the movie, if I'm listening to a song and they skip a cuss word, I don't want no more parts of this no more for real. Yeah. And it's wild because like I mean, do it matter for real? But like, yeah, nah, it ain't supposed to be like this. I don't this. want it that. I want it to be. <laughs> hey, you better not put no commercials in this bitch. It makes perfect sense to me, man. I forgot. I didn't write that down, and I thought we should, you know, I knew you wanted to talk about that. And what? What I wanted to talk about? The hood movie thing. You oh, know? the hood so, shit. Yeah. You know, shit, you know, we we fucking, we Boosie fans now. I'm a Boosie fan. Yeah, man. I thought fuck, fuck with Boosie, man. Yeah. So fuck. Right. I got I got a pivot question. All right. Okay, then. What what do you think the the top uh drug movie of all time is? Scarface. Mm. Scarface? Scarface. Um It gotta be. Scarface. I, you know that's what I would have said for a long time off rip. But I I might I might go with blow. Blow pretty good too. I gotta go. Scott I haven't face, seen it though. in a while though. But the more I talk or hear, like hear conversations about Scarface, the less I'm I'm appreciative of the whole movie really? itself. Like the the actual movie, I fuck is with pretty you. regular. I mean, it's it's regular. No, nah, <laughs> fuck that. It's Wasn't it not like that at that time? For not, real? Yeah, no. Nah, but when you go back and look at it again, there's things that still hold up for a certain. Like coming to America is coming to America, bro. Yeah, like but, but Scarface, Scarface is still if Scarface. You go back, it's, it is because I you have watch the fuck the out of Scarface right from now from that from from. No, no, that it's still a good movie time. though. But <laughs> if you go to the plot of it, 
Scarface is better pot. than coming to America. I'm not. I'm just talking about the the movie as itself and how it held up in time as far as the plot, the writing, the originality of it. Scarface kind of goes down a little notch or two for me if you put in all those little factors that you would really compare to other things like that for. Like what other drug movies? The Blow? Blow better than Scarface. I think it had a better storyline. Um, but Scarface set the standard, though, didn't it? I like, like it was. I like, like Training Day. <clears throat> what was I'd before Scarface? Scar- yeah, Scarface. yeah, Training Day for sure, Trinidad but not over Scarface. Mm. Training Day was a cop movie. More so, but it was a heavy. It wasn't a whole lot of drugs. He was a drug in dealer. The whole movie. It wasn't a whole lot of drugs in there, though. It wasn't no. about drugs. Okay, that's fair. Scarface was. I about. never really. I never saw all the Goodfathers. Scarface and blow and shit. That's about a motherfucking selling drugs. Yeah. <coughs> like, did you ever watch Breaking Bad? <coughs> I did. I did. I really like Breaking Bad. Yeah, I fucked with Breaking Bad. Walter White now. Oh, Jesse. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I don't. I and I again. That's one of them topics where I probably ain't the best person to ask about the movies. Trying I don't remember movies like shit, that. Though. Yeah, dude. Because could you imagine being in a motorhome, in the desert, in your drawers with another grown motherfucking man for any reason at of, all? And a bunch of uh, science lab equipment. Just finna blow the fuck up. Man. For any reason whatsoever, though. Me and you were never going to be in a motorhome well, yeah, in but he, he, Yeah, but he was dying. He was just trying to leave some money for the fan. I guess. Jesse was just a druggie. Yeah, like, it was yeah. the perfect story. Yeah, I mean, it made sense. It was smooth as shit. It was a way to try to figure out how do two grown men end up in their drawers and truck in the desert. I'm not doing it. So, I think that would have been. That's rock bottom. That's rock bottom. <laughs> he, was right about, there. he was there. He he couldn't get no job and shit. It's fucked up. Um, you want to talk about some serious shit? Not really, but I guess we got to sometime. Yeah. I I unfortunately came across this. Um, I think Mike got the clip for it. How serious is serious? I don't know. You you want to take a break and then talk about it? Oh, let's talk about it. Oh, you want to take a break? Yeah, let's take a little five minute break. Take a little break, out there. We're gonna be we're back right. with some we're serious don't shit. Don't Scented candles in their home. I think scented candles are one of the most dangerous things that you can do to uh, make your indoor air quality unhealthy. First of all, these candles are made from paraffin. Paraffin is a petroleum product. You're burning basically petroleum, knowingly, willingly, in your own home environment. These candles release into their air, alkanes and alkenes, which are also found in car exhaust. Then scented candles, to make matters worse, they're scented generally with artificial fragrances. And what's in every single artificial fragrance? An ingredient called phthalates, another petroleum product that is a no serious hormone disruptor. People enjoy. That's why I don't know. Yeah, Blow that shit out. Wild. Blow that shit out. I guess so. Right? I'm going to have to do some more research on this. I feel like I'm going to finish the candle I just bought, though. <laughs> I'm going to have to do some more research on crack this. crack that window. I'll be crack having my window windows window, open, man. though. Thankfully, I thought about that. Like, I'll really be having my windows open all the time. With yeah, no, we blown. be in this motherfucker. She, yeah, yeah. she had one in every goddamn room, God damn no. it. So, this every room smell like a different fucking tree. And the incense, too, like... Air room smell like a different tree, God damn Not it. A different tree. Everything. No blueberries. Ain't and shit in here. Cookies and cakes. You can't have a pop tart. <laughs> a goddamn pop tart. Yeah, I thought about oh, it. I thought about it between, rolls I smell. between the candle I just got because I, I do like having some candles. I try different ones because a lot of times when I find one that I really like, because I don't get them all the time. It's too high time. for me. Yeah, I'm, I'm that's not, why I don't get them all the time. I'm finna pay fifteen. But I'll finally find one that I like five. and be like, "Oh, this the one I'm getting every time." And then that bitch be gone. It would be it's like old. discontinued. That's happened two, at least Somebody two times. Somebody got counsel from me. Somebody got counsel from me. So maybe. Yeah, that's what happened. Get that shit off the market. They already because that's already the only one they was buying. It was the only one they was buying. No, I be asked. I'm thing. talking about whoever caught the counsel from me. Oh, they that was, was buying them me. one. Yeah, that was going to be you if things gonna sell out. with the cancel. Yeah. From the but cancel. they ain't had their windows open. Yeah, I be having my windows open. They ain't had their windows open. 
But yeah, I, between and a fan that, blowing and then, that shit out the window, exactly. <laughs> and and you know the candles that she be making and be having a candle in here sometimes. And oh yeah, she make thinking, candles like, all the time. Yeah, yeah. My, I know my sister go and grab some candles sometimes. Have some candles burning. Like, it makes sense though, because I mean it'd be a strong ass smell or whatever the fuck going on yeah. in the air. I be thinking about that, like what's evaporating out of it. Yeah. Yeah. I never like looked it up, but I do look at the candle and think next time I light it, like, but what's I mean, gone from you? What the fuck? I'm, what you you sit in traffic, you breathing in fucking exhaust for you. But you don't think the corn had any? I mean, not no more than no. Nah, that's cool. Than what you breathing in anyway? That's cool. But now the photosynthesis system and shit. Clear all this shit up. And so do your body as long as you drink some water and eat some healthy stuff. Unless you got a candle. Uh, with your windows closed. Then you fucked up. You hey, fucked you compared it way. to car car exhaust. Yeah, he did. He, and he we talk it. about, like, so what happens if you inhale enough car exhaust, uh, monoxide, you're going to yeah, die. Yeah, you're going to die. Like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's why that corn but, ain't no good but, on but that. But I still head. feel like he probably exaggerated it a little bit. <laughs> It'd be the. Because petroleum is in a lot of shit, for real, for Thanks. real. But we don't burn it and inhale it in we a lot of do shit. That. We don't do that. Put it on your lips. Shit. You do put this shit on your lips, goddamn yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. That kind don't burn the same. That, it don't burn. You can't, you can't set the lip chap. Chapstick on I said lip chap. <laughs> you did lip chap. I didn't chap, know what that lip chap was. You said the chapstick on fire? I don't know. I never tried that. Oh, shit. You it's said this petroleum shit like you jelly or something. No, I'm talking though, about like man. Vaseline. Yeah. Vaseline. I'm, maybe they put something in there, but it's still petroleum, the base of this shit. Yeah, that's what it says. And maybe it's that's a certain cheap way. One. I'm finna get a flamethrower and see how to make this shit burn. <laughs> yeah. All right. dollars Bet. Uh, is it time? But look at that. Oh shit! Fucking look at that! Oh shit! What you fucking look at that? Shit! Absolutely, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's about that time. It's about that time it's that we about get. That time. Oh, time during the morning show. Oh, I didn't know. Okay. Oh, oh. it ain't that time. No. Peel. <laughs> it must be time for Reddit on Reddit, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. This is got them Reddit on Reddit. This for us. Us three. I'm We're leaving. the smokers. Wow. Me, Bob, Off White Mike. Count yes. two. I'm leaving. Say it again. Hey, I'm leaving. You going? Yeah. What? That's, that's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm fed up. That's fucked up. That's enough. Oh, oh, oh. It's the times. <laughs> hey, look, it's Tom Jordan, ladies and gentlemen, your host. I'm just doing this shit so some old bitches can get on the boat, goddamn. But I got a cruise going <laughs> on, goddamn. We'll come try to, goddamn, bring you to the Miss Tom Jordan. Stole his swag. Steve Harvey, mm-hmm. Radio Morning Talk Show host. Oh shit! But um, yeah, uh, I'm I'll be yeah. out track. We sometime. missed the drop. The drops um, are done. It's, it's, it always happened like that. Yeah, it always, but oh. it's your fault. <laughs> this is a part of the I'm show. I'm a reverend. I can do this. <laughs> <laughs> Where we find things on Reddit. On Reddit. What and we, we do read with the things that are on Reddit. <laughs> shit. If you read some shit off Reddit, what so we call? call this part of the show Reddit on Reddit. It makes perfect. Fucking we are. Sense. The best advice givers. Us three. We are the council that you need to seek counsel from. The council. Absolutely. The council. We are the like people that. that are here for your betterment, your well-being, that's and everything that could be for positive you. for your existence. And that's why we are doing this right now for you. And we appreciate you joining Wait us and us. taking the time. And maybe you might need to contact us with a problem, a qualm, an issue, a setback. Maybe a triumph, even, that you want to share with the Smoking Permitted Podcast. You can contact us at 256-788-7339. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. And you could replace the Reddit on Reddit for the next episode. It could be you. It no, might not be you. It. They'll it, be it on could here, be you. too. I said it could. Nah, that ain't even possible. Give them hope. <laughs> no. I mean, you could be on here next to the Reddit on Reddit. You could Jeez. replace the Reddit on Reddit next time. I guess. If Reddit shit next down. So possibly, <laughs> if you send something in for us to read or review or, if I forget or to use. Look up or Reddit if Kato Reddit. forgets to send me the Reddit on Reddit. Then you could the replace the Reddit on Reddit. Is everybody ready? Bob was right. I think I'm ready. 
You ready, bro? Ready. Ready on ready number one. Number one. Number one. one. Okay, D. All right. Uh, Okay, here we go. I got married six months ago. All right. I have a seven-year-old son who's by another man. Okay. He takes great care of his son. For Thanksgiving, every year, I go to my mom's house. Okay. My son's father always meets us there to eat dinner. Okay. This year, my husband told me either tell my son's father that he cannot come to dinner or neither my son or myself can go to my mother's for Thanksgiving dinner. I don't know what to do. How can I best handle this situation? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's a little serious. That's serious as hell right there. Yeah. Oh, shit. All right. So she recently got married. She's a newlywed Newly still. Newlywed. Six months. She has a seven-year-old son with somebody that means she had at least a seven-year relationship of some extent. No, don't. It means she had a relationship years. seven years ago. No. Or eight years ago. It didn't mean the relationship was seven years long. No. It's been seven years yeah, okay. since this kid's yeah. been alive, so there's been some type of relationship for this amount of time. At least, for at least seven years. Yeah. Okay. Man. He might right, not have been right, there right. through the pregnancy because then we might have to push it to eight. But if he was there, let's say eight. <laughs> he coming to Thanksgiving at the girl mama yeah, house. Yeah, that's every why I year. said probably eight. We're gonna say eight. eight yeah, there. So at least eight years, almost a decade worth of time. We're gonna say ten. Now, yeah, cause we don't know how long they, they like would date for they made for they conceive. Yeah, they, they, they like conceive. each other. Fuck you. Um, Backstory. <laughs> yeah, add to it. Let's just make up their life. Man, okay. Uh, <laughs> like, nah, I ain't even know the nigga. I just fuck with <laughs> And then the I one time the nigga just happened to be a baby. The nigga popped up after seven years, two Thanksgivings ago. I saw the diploma. <laughs> mm. So, what's, what I'm curious about that's not in here is how long she's been with the person that she just married. Um, but I guess either way, he still set a boundary, and he wants her to not let to not allow her baby daddy to come to Thanksgiving dinner at her mom's house no more. That's what she want. That's what, what say he, ye? That's what he want. What say ye? Mm. So me, my opinion, it's two ways you can handle this shit. The little boy go with his daddy for Thanksgiving now. Whatever the fuck they want to go do, you ain't got to go to your mama's house. With whatever. The little boy go with his daddy for Thanksgiving now. Or this new nigga, you come to Thanksgiving with everybody else. <laughs> God this baby. new nigga. The, the new it's nigga. A, it's a battle rapper that be doing that. Funny. <laughs> no. You watch a battle rap? I ain't seen nah, that one, though. Nah, yeah, yeah, I watch it, but I ain't seen that one. He be like, this nigga. Like, he be, I hope, he be, oh, right. Never mind, my bad. Shout I'm out sorry. to that nigga. Yeah. But yeah, this new, this new nigga... <laughs> I almost say nigger. <laughs> this nah, we ain't you did, we are, see, it's hard not to when you do it like that. That's, that's weird, no? Up. Yeah, that's fucked up. Yo, it's fucked up. I didn't even that's, know that about myself. Me neither. That's weird. To, oh. Yeah, I just found that out like you Racist did. Like, fuck. wait a minute, what Damn. you want to say? <laughs> no, slow down, slow down. <laughs> Well, yeah, the new nigga can go to goddamn Thanksgiving too. Shit, fuck it. That's the only way. You can't keep this son from his daddy on Thanksgiving if this son been seeing his daddy on Thanksgiving. Or you a hard ass nigga for real? Ain't no way around that in my book for real. I don't know though. I no? don't know what she. There's not enough context here. Context here for me to really have, I think, a fair opinion about this because. I don't know how long they've been together. I don't know how many times he's tried to have a conversation with her about how he feels about them spending time or or whatever's happening, whatever the 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 um what's it not diaspora but the uh, the environment the however your family building is, however your vibe is with your family or your All unit right. or whatever. Yeah, they be smoking so, weed over here. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm saying if that's how it is, and they know like you know it's, it might be that. So it might be different if he like you going over there still to see this nigga every year. Like y'all still, I like I don't well, know. Maybe she stay know. home and send the son to the mama house for things. That's why I if said he just the son popped up out of daddy. nowhere, if he just all of a sudden was like, "Hey, no mo," then that's I think th- then you could have a conversation. I feel like this they first Thanksgiving to go. 
Mm. I feel like this is new for real. I think they we need some more context. I mean, uh, we, we, always, we, we don't know if, if there's some kind of tension between the two dudes. Well, she's, so I don't know. The you way, know. Yeah, right, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, it, well, she they'll does, never give us enough. The way that this is stated, when it says, this year, my husband told me, because it's this year, comma, my husband told me to either tell uh, my son's father that he cannot come to dinner or... Neither my son or myself can go to my mother's for Thanksgiving dinner. So this the first dinner. one or the second one? It could be they did that shit last year, and he was like, yeah, nah, this year we ain't going for this shit. <laughs> <laughs> right. Or it could be the first one, like, y'all be doing what? Like, every year, y'all just, hey, nah, fuck that. We ain't doing that shit this year. So either way, mm-hmm. it's the first one or the second one, I feel like, now. So how do you think she should handle this? I, I agree. I, I think, you know, so if I was in that situation, let's say I'm, I married somebody you, in that situation. You, you, you six right? months in. So, so how would I handle that? And, and let's say issues with fine. I, I think I'm secure that I wouldn't mind him still coming. Yeah. yeah. But that's just me though. But I, I can see. But if there's turmoil, and it depends on how she acting too though. But if she all a different motherfucker around me and around him, I you know what I'm saying. But then, yeah, they won't say- but then you also got yeah, that's true. Take too. the kid in mind too though, because then you're also thinking seven years of breaking this tradition of father, mother. Uh, Grandmother. grandparents or yeah. whatever the family Hell. and that's you're breaking that get together up too so are you be mindful of that but so maybe so if there was an issue I would just have to make my own what about Thanksgiving what about so the fuck what yeah I'm breaking that up now it's my turn bitch this is my family now yeah, yeah. You, you actually had that right you had that right to say that because you are the husband <laughs> You are the, you know, right. saying the man, the leader, yeah. whatever in a relationship. Yeah, uh, you have the right to say or express whether you are or not. You can express that. Yeah, absolutely. And then, then she's got a decision to make, and then you got a decision to make. Well, she's saying, what decision does she make? Because that's what he's you, saying. You can't. I feel like if you a man in this situation, he said, I'm the pappy, and you you can't keep that man away from his son. That's wild to say. I mean, you can. I guess he didn't it, say it that. He like, said for Thanksgiving he can't come over during to, family for to in laws yeah. house. You ain't coming to mom or your mama's house. Yeah, they, you they, ain't coming to my mother in law house. He can't say that. You notice what he said because the mama ain't with that bullshit. Yeah, he ain't say that. About the mom. Yeah, he ain't say yeah, that. He cool can't with. come over there. But we don't even know. The mom might be happy if he be like no more of him. No, I'm tired <laughs> of this nigga. No, that man, send the son with his daddy then. For Thanksgiving, I agree with that too, you send though. the yeah, son yeah. with his daddy, <clears throat> yeah. and y'all go watch a football game or some shit. Hell. So what does she want to, what, what about her going over there, too? Yeah, he said neither one of them can, can go. This nigga sound real controlling, too. I would man. say yeah. insecure. Yeah. Look, it's, that's why I say I would feel, I would feel okay. I mean, that's part of it. Like that's part, <clears throat> excuse me, what they did, and I had some similarity like that in in, in, in uh, with my ex wife and my marriage in situation where you know uh, the father of uh, my ex wife's child was there, but it didn't bother me because you know what I'm saying I was yeah, secure like, with different things, yeah. you know what I'm saying. But it wasn't no disrespectful shit going on either. The family yeah. was family, wasn't no slick shit being said. So those are uncomfortable positions that we don't want to be in. Yeah, he might have went in through the Thanksgiving like, forward, like, like yeah, shit, know. we married now and I ain't putting up with that shit no more. You know, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, it could have been a previous one. Like, right. nah, I, I see how yeah. it go down now. And, if you marry a chick who's got kids. Excuse me. And, I mean, you, by the time you're married, you should know if they the kid's father's around or not. Right, right. You're going to have to deal with that for yeah. real. That's part you, of it. Yeah, that's, that's a package. Whether motherfucker like it or not, that motherfucker <laughs> part of that package, too. Yeah. When the chick be like, oh, it's a package. I come with the... Yeah, the package is bigger than just the kid for real. It's a big ass package. It's a nigga over there. Too. I knew some paw shit was gonna end up happening right at the right after. That. I knew it. So I what? Knew it. Some paw shit. What happened? That's why I didn't say nothing the whole time. You just, I said something out of the yeah. package. Yeah, it's a big ass package. Oh shit! I don't <laughs> even be. There I mean, wasn't no way to describe to finish describing how you started that. Yeah, you're right. I said it a few a times. So. Yeah. I was, but yeah, I mean that's the deal. Like yeah, all this is. shit come together for real. You got to definitely take package. it. Take it into consideration. You know, I mean, that's what you're getting into. Hell, and, and it's, it's you wild. You're flipping the helm on the TV. No. Uh, <laughs> no. Well, all right. And hey, that's how we do on here. Hey, the right. Yeah. Right. <laughs> we sync this shit up. Real yeah, silly. you do got to take that into consideration. And, oh, you know, I never, I didn't even think about that. I might have fun being like the ruining shit. Really? I might. Hey, fuck it, I ain't. So you the baby daddy. Yeah. You just over this bitch. Like, hey, nigga, you want some mashed potatoes, nigga? Yeah. 
<laughs> you don't want no ass potatoes? Come here, son. Come here, son. You got feeding nigga. I'm finna go take a shit. <laughs> you good? You good? Yeah, <laughs> quick. Come here, son. Nah, no, that's petty. I ain't gonna do Man, that. All right. Welcome to the family. Yeah, we're going outside. We're going. Let's go, <laughs> let's go take a walk, bro. Let's go talk about something. I feel like walking shit. right now. No, nah, you ain't got to. I don't feel like it. We talk right here. We go outside. We talk right here right now. Mama gonna be mad. Talk right here right now. Nah, yeah, that that I it got to be some niggas that do that shit on purpose. You know it is. It bro. You know it is. Disruptive. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, yeah. I guess um, for as far as advice for her, uh, send that boy with his dad for Thanksgiving. She got to go too. No, she ain't got to go. She go she with your go with your happy. new controlling man. Yeah, yeah. 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 y'all gonna do some shit. <coughs> Whatever the fuck he want to do, <laughs> you probably gonna end up doing the same thing. Your son and his daddy gonna be doing. That man gonna make you watch football. On Thanksgiving. <laughs> 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 So yeah, you do that shit. And tell Six you to give him his plate in. first. Man, all right. <laughs> Ain't nobody else here. <laughs> it's just them two. <laughs> and this little Caesars. Cause she can't fucking cook. <laughs> Why they at a mama house? Right. All right. We'll leave this lady alone. Poor lady. Hey, you're right. We supposed to be up there, right? Um, I think that. <laughs> I think it really depends on your relationship with dude. He might fuck, you might, like, there's a lot of people, and I think it's weird, but there are a lot of people, at least it seems to me, that have relationships with their ex's family after they're, after they become an ex. And I don't see why that would be something that you would want to carry on, but if that's kind of how things go and you also have a kid, I could see that happening. And this one time a year, Y'all get together or whatever. You kept the tradition going from the time that y'all were together or whatever. Yeah, yeah. that's um, what I feel like going on. Here. But I don't know fully from this if she really wants him there. No, or it sounds like she want to. She really want to say, "How can I tell this nigga not to come to Thanksgiving for her?" Yeah, that's kind <laughs> that's of the Bible. What she really want to say? That's kind of. I was trying to get this. Yeah, yeah. Yes, <laughs> that's what she want to say. I wasn't gonna do. So- Snitch on them. But like yeah, that. nah, if you if, if anybody if you feel like there's a reason that you have for trying to make things more comfortable for you and your family and your children or your child, I'm sorry. That's the new name. Then your marriage. If that's though. what you yeah, if that's what you're committing to and you saying that that's what you going by, then I think you should go by that shit. Sitting the boy with his dad. If you say these are the vows and vows are vows and all that bullshit, all that stuff. <laughs> Keep a son away from his dad It shouldn't be in your motherfucking files <laughs> You gotta go by what you, what you stand you gotta... He a controlling ass nigga And sound like he a whole ass nigga Hey y'all might y'all might get an annulment You might be divorced in a year In ten years who knows But for right now I think you gotta Go with what You know what I'm saying I want everybody It don't sound like you ready to have a conversation with them two And it don't sound like he wanna talk to him either I want so. everybody to go to fucking Thanksgiving And tell me how that <laughs> shit went I, I think too. I think I think what will help out the most is if she asks herself this question that how does she feel about does she want him there? You know what I mean? Yeah. The, I mean, the father, the sound, child. You know what I'm saying? It don't sound like she wanted. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. I don't really know. She she and she she maybe now has a way or an excuse. An excuse to, to get him up out of there. Mm. Well, my nigga said you can't come, no. Well, bitch, I will be there for y'all get there. Shit, yeah. <laughs> fuck with yeah, you he, and him talking about it. Man, okay. Yeah, it's, it's fucking, it's yeah, Tuesday, man. I'm going down. Right. right. I'll be there right. on the Thursday. Fuck right. you talking about. I'm make sure the oven works. Man, she, okay. yeah. I got a new one, <laughs> so I know she gonna let me in. i <laughs> 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 Thanksgiving, I got a new stove, yeah. <laughs> All right. Shit. I hope you take that to heart. You use it to the best of your ability, and and your life is great, prosper, prosperity, love and peace, and all that. Don't keep the door um, from your dad on Thanksgiving. I don't know. Uh, y'all ready? I'm ready for it. Ready. Reddit on Reddit number two. Number two. Number, number, two. number, number two. 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 All right. The title is 
<laughs> fuck shit, man. Like, I'm look, but listen, I'm looking for Reddit. I'm scrolling through Reddit, looking for Reddit, and this shit pops up. What the fuck? I'm I'm not supposed to fucking screenshot this shit right here. I'm not supposed to screenshot this shit right here. I had to see it. You had to see it. You got to see it too. And now they got to see it. Goddamn it. <laughs> I'm not supposed to screenshot this shit right here. The title is Friend Masturbated Next to Me While He Was While He Thought I Was Asleep. <laughs> <laughs> they why, man. They why. His friend to fuck him. <laughs> I guess I just made it two dudes, didn't it? I ain't even had to make it. We don't even it don't know that got, much. It don't matter. It don't, we don't even I've know never that much. masturbated it be, next it to nobody. No, but it, it makes a difference. No. If it's no. a girlfriend next <coughs> and the dude or the, or the female masturbating. Was I it mean, a female female? That's what oh, I'm saying. Yeah, I, we, don't, we don't know that much okay, yet, okay, but okay, it, it gotcha. makes a difference for real. If, I've, if I've it's never two masturbated dudes. next to no sleep person. I mean, period. that's weird. Uh, that's weird itself. You're absolutely right. right. That's weird by itself. <laughs> but it's still, it's different. If it's two dudes, uh, a dude and a girl. Is it not? It, that all depends. It, it's different. Not if it's two dudes that like dudes. Well, then, yeah, but I'm just saying. You well, know, you know what I'm friend, saying, though. Yeah, yeah. There's some levels of that. If it's yeah. two people that are the same sexual preference, it's weird as fuck. <laughs> no. Either way, I just think it's weird. But um, unless it's two girls, then you. it's porn. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> it's fucked up. So so chauvinistic. Man, um, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> That's wild. All right. It says, my friend and I are on a trip in Mexico. Currently, we're sharing a bed. Both 21-year-old males. See, like, yeah. the first two sentences are fucked up as we, shit. Like, we weird already. what are you doing? In Mexico, in bed with another motherfucker? All right. Y'all knew what was happening. <laughs> Y'all knew what the fuck this was. <laughs> Do it on the gay trip and now he's gay. Right. He got flew out. He got flew out. Yeah. Now you don't want to participate. You knew what it was. You was lifting the bag on the plane. Man, okay. <laughs> it's one bed in the room. Hey, no, no, no. It's a twin bed, too. That's not what we're doing. That's not what we, you got to cuddle. Somebody come fall out this bitch if you don't. <laughs> Oh, he got blued out to a twin bed well, in Mexico. <laughs> which if you don't do it, check out there. You can't for you'll never be seen again. <laughs> oh shit, we'll never help him do it. That's fucked up. He's finna get kidnapped. That was two sentences. We didn't get to it. That's fucked. But I already know. Oh my god, you already in some weird shit. You in Mexico oh. in bed with another man? It's horrible. That don't make no sense. Oh, okay. And you not getting? I was asleep and I wake up. To the bed shaking and loud breathing. <laughs> I look over and bam, he's beating his meat. <laughs> bam. <Bail. laughs> oh shit. I can't the bed breathe. is shaking and there's loud oh, breathing. Oh yeah, he going in. <laughs> what the fuck? He don't care. He, go, he meant to wake him up. What you mean? <laughs> he he, he, he this know shit. what the oh, fuck he is. He mad. He mad. You like, he you mad. know what you thought yeah. this was. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> like you, gonna, you gonna hear me get this <laughs> off. <laughs> Motherfucker. He knew what the fuck it's was your fault I'm over here doing this. Hell, I don't Damn. even know why he's here. Yeah, I don't know if we can give you no advice. You knew what the fuck this was. That's pretty aggressive. Is that all of it? I feel like dropping him and leaving him in the past after this. Yeah, you, yeah. He's been getting on my nerves a lot lately, but mm. this is the final straw. It should be. What would you do? Yeah, it should be absolutely yeah, the final straw. Yeah, that's your boyfriend. Straw. This is man okay. Stop playing, bro. <laughs> <laughs> my give, friend and I are on a trip. Give him that pussy. 
<laughs> if we both shared a bed. We're both 21 year old males. Yeah, that's your right. boyfriend. Yeah, that's definitely your boyfriend. And you on Reddit in denial. And you bullshit. Yeah, you ain't want to give it up. I would slept on the fucking floor. You was I would have slept outside. Yeah, ain't no way we. <laughs> I'm sleeping outside, goddammit. <laughs> ain't no way in hell. This is your fault. Is that who fault? Yours. No, nah, I ain't know what was going Yours. on. Yours. I just saw the this title. Your fault. I just saw the title. And, I take responsibility. That's making it fault. your fault. Yes, you're right. It's your fault. <laughs> you absolutely that we right. We're here right you're now. You're absolutely cause... right. But it's really their fault. No. Because they was in the It ain't even together. them. It's the one dude who don't like his boyfriend no, but flew him out to Mexico <laughs> anyway to share a twin <laughs> bed and, and not give up Mexico no pussy. And don't do that. Yeah. <laughs> You all in the ocean with the sharks and shit. You bullshit. All the way bullshit. We got, we got this spice ass corn and shit. You talking about that? <laughs> we that motherfucker in Mexico. <laughs> bullshit. That's wild as hell. I'm sorry. What would you do? It's my fault. I wouldn't have flew him out. <laughs> Man, okay. If that was my boyfriend I ain't like, I wouldn't have flew him out. You got to know if you fight oh, before you come out here. <laughs> that don't make no sense. You knew y'all wasn't having sex for your for for you flew for y'all was like you was like you know what that's what it was ah that's what it was. What it was? The boyfriend that was humping the bed thought he was finally gonna get some because they hadn't been having no sex, but the one that wasn't giving it up flew him out. We had the wrong person flying the wrong person. I don't person think out. so. I don't, I, I don't think so. He thought they was going to go repair their relationship because he'd been getting on his nerves. He'd been over the dude for a while. I, he I, thought I, we was going to go on vacation. We was going to have a good time. We was going to put some some spark back into this love of ours. And the other dude was like, I'm going to get some bussy. <laughs> yeah, I, I, think, I don't think one of these people know they that what supposed to be. Fucking on this trip for real. No, nah, they together. I don't think nah, one I mean, of them know that though. Two different intentions. On this, yeah, I think so. I think yeah, one just thought it was gonna be a he no trip. He, he was out here with his friend for real. Nah, <laughs> but now once you see his one now bed, you, though, you masturbated next to him, <laughs> yeah, and the you, bed was shaking and you, you was breathing yeah, loud. Now you know for certain. Yeah, <laughs> it's for certain. Wait, you what saying? His yeah, but you saying dude talking didn't know. Yeah, I don't. I don't think so. But I, fig- I figure once you once you see his one bed, then you know something weird. But he might but he be the a- one. I'm saying he the one that paid for it. I don't think he paid for he it. Did. I think he got flued out there for real. Nah, he the one. That or paid maybe for they it. went in on that bitch or something. He the one that paid for it. I don't he think he, he paid for it. The relationship and the other dude thought he was getting pushed. Yeah, I don't think he know he in a relationship. They in a relationship. I think he figured out when he <laughs> woke think, up to but the bed but, but, but for me, though, if they was in a relationship, he wouldn't give a fuck about I didn't, I didn't beat my meat next to my girlfriend before. Yeah, yeah, he no wouldn't. Wife or, if anything, you know he'd be like, why this like, for like real? she was just sleep and you were just going to town? I mean, shit, if it had a, yeah. I ain't saying I'm shaking the motherfucking bed, that. but this is what I'm saying. Like, because <laughs> I ain't mad. I'm saying, now you saying, yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, so, so check breathing. it out. I don't think it was no relationship because, <laughs> yeah, I think because why, why would he, yeah, why would he even care then? You know what I'm saying? It ain't going to be no issue. I if they in a relationship, that's, you know, shit, you, you fucking, whatever you're doing, you know what I'm saying? Hell, that ain't nothing new. I think he was like, yeah, ain't no way they wasn't in a relationship and he beat his meat like that next to him. No, I that's think, what I'm saying. I think he, he would. Thought- he was he advertising thought, mad, though. He probably mad if he's shaking the bed, bro. I think the dude writing might be a little naive or maybe gullible. And the dude got there. He just wanted a free trip. The, yeah, the dude beating his, <laughs> beating no, his I meat in the bed. He, he, don't, he don't really know how to say what he want. So, goddamn, he's like, hey, buddy, you, you want to go to Mexico? Take a trip to Mexico or whatever. Either they went in on the shit or died. And they, yeah, we go to Mexico. Oh, it's just one bed. He tried to Dwight Howard him. He, I think he did out yeah, there for real, for real. Damn. He probably did something that did woke up and he was beating his dick. Well, be more careful, buddy. Absolutely. Don't go to Mexico. Wear some chastity drawers when you hang out with your homies. Man, you don't know them how to ain't pick your them. homies. <laughs> them is not your fucking You don't know homies. how to pick them, so whoever your homies <laughs> I, is. I think we talked about now. this in the yeah. last episode about the Mountain Dew people. If, if yeah, you yeah, see yeah. your homies' penis... It's not your friend no more. Not your friend. 
<laughs> yeah, whoa. Yeah, no. <laughs> now, why would, damn it, Kato. You got to sever that relationship. It's a horrible thought to put into no? somebody's head. But you got to sever, you got to sever that relationship now. I don't even know, but that, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> um, I'm not your homies. <laughs> they're not, they're not your homies, man. I'm not your homies. <laughs> I don't See, know where I, to go for that. Think, where we I at think, on time? I think uh, right one thirty five. I just think I just think if you know if you don't like something, just don't fuck with it. Like six, seven, ties, whatever the fuck it is. If it's a whatever, you know, let's cut the shit. shit. Don't fuck if, with it. That's the answer. Yeah. If if somebody wakes you up by shaking the bed from masturbating, <laughs> no more you probably Mexico should trips. get away from yeah. the mini That's right no now. No more trips for right real. now. Yeah. That's. I don't know. Maybe I'm being judgmental. You should spring up suddenly and say, what the fuck? (laughs) Don't be subtle about it. No, don't be subtle. (laughs) And if they say me and you, what the fuck? (laughs) What the fuck can get you all the way out of this situation for real? (laughs) You just got to say it louder each time. (laughs) Or you open the door to y'all twin bedroom room. Say it again. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> so not anybody else. You got their attention too. Because <laughs> you in danger for real. <laughs> I don't know. If you don't got a way home, you might have to get out of that situation a little calmer. I, I don't know. I don't, it'll fit yeah. on how, how far yeah. you is in Mexico? Across the saying. border. Across the border. <laughs> they held my main up from dialysis. I watched one of the episodes of that shit across some. Something about the shit getting across the border and shit. Mm-hmm. They thought one dude had a warrant in some city. It's and the up. dude that was riding with him, they was headed, they was like two, they would have been there plenty, plenty of time. But two hours later, they still waiting to see if dude actually got a warrant or not. And so the old man still didn't get, he was still waiting. Like, I got to go die, do my yeah, dialysis. Yeah. And they was like, yeah. Just gotta wait a little longer. Man, boy, he finna die. <laughs> yeah, but he yeah. got a warrant. He ran like two red lights, guy, baby. <laughs> yeah, type shit. The fuck? The fuck yeah, about nah, this I old came man? back and it was like, oh yeah, nah, it's cool. Y'all, y'all can go. We could go. Yeah. Bitch, oh man, die right here so we can have a case. <laughs> fuck that. Die right yeah. here. <laughs> fuck no, that. I'm saying, you may, make sure you got a ride back from Mexico before you go too far. Hey, that be the fucked up part. I know this off subject and shit, but the police could almost do. Whatever the fuck they want to do. And then just be like, yeah, shit, my bad. Yeah. Not even my bad. Just get the fuck out yeah, for just, real. Oh, yeah, we were following procedure. <laughs> Motherfucker tear every seat out your car and put that bitch <laughs> on the side of the road. Yeah. And don't find shit. Yeah. And be like, all right, dude. Hey, yeah. bitch, what? <laughs> fuck out of here. What the fuck? You to put these <laughs> in? <laughs> <laughs> fuck you take these out. Bitch, you a cop. I the fuck a mechanic. Yeah, all right, I kick in your motherfucking dope. Yeah, they, they got a search it. one, but if they ain't got no dope in this motherfucker, it don't fucking matter. No. Your dope fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> it. Hope you have renter's insurance Man, okay. homeowner's insurance. No, they not finna come for that. One. This is a police raid. You might get uh. dropped if you tell them for real. <laughs> yeah. I insurance. Yeah, no, nah, they the kicked person. in my fucking dope. No, they had a search warrant. I said that part. Yeah, yeah they had the wrong person though. No, if they got a search warrant, they got the right person. No. Yeah, that's not true at all. You just got the right time. Yeah, that's not true at all. They, they be having the wrong shit. They be having the wrong shit. That's time. Get yeah. my dough back. You know what I'm saying? If they got the wrong address, like we were supposed to be over there, then they gonna pay for this shit. Yeah. But if they were supposed to be over here, that's what oh, the yeah. paper say. Yeah, like. You fucked up. You got to pay for this shit. Even if it ain't shit in here for real. That's some wild shit for real. That is wild. That's I don't, you keep trying to end this on a horrible point. We was talking about Let's the post. I'm sorry. Yeah. The fuck 12 shit. Fuck them. All this shit. Bitch. Boo. It was a bitch. Oh. Yeah. As long as it wasn't Cyrus. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we appreciate y'all fucking with us. Yeah. I am Reverend Kato Jackson. That oh, is Bob Jacquez. That is Off White Mike for Lino. God damn it. We is the Smoking for Me podcast. And one more thing, we is is at this bitch. Oh, oh shit, what happened? Oh Don't shit, forget. tell them what not to do. Android is not a type of phone, cinnamon is not hey. sweet. Pull I your see, pockets out if Rico you got an iron, otherwise, get a steamer. We're going to say the best. It's two races of phone. It's two races of phone. 
Android is not a type of phone. I'm just saying. Cinnamon is not sweet. Pull your pockets out or pull your shirt inside out if you got an iron. If not, get you a steamer. Um, if she know all the music to dope. Oh, man. You already know. Hey, I hey you ain't think you I thought about know. that when the, <laughs> hey if she know all the words to all the dope boy Burr. songs, it's cause all she did was ride around listening to dope boy music with dope boys. Just, you know, sit on it, King. Also, just remember, all she wanna do is come over, eat some chicken wings, and take a nap on your couch. Um, oh. I mean fucked up. That's all she wanna do. You don't really gotta do much. You could do whatever the fuck you wanna do. Just let her have some chicken wings and take a nap on your couch. You be nah, good, King. No you be good. What you got? Um, don't let the bitch sleep on your couch. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nap. It's a nap. Don't see, let her stay there overnight. See, never leave. Yeah, it yeah, no, it's a yeah, nap. Hey, one nap. Oh, no. and tomorrow we spend Oh, you got to do it right. Y'all don't know how to do it right? Uh, I'll do it. <laughs> Man, don't worry. Just let her um, take a nap. Don't let her stay there tonight. You got to distinguish those differences. It is a big difference, though. Smoke, <laughs> smoke a blunt with your mama. Probably change your life. Do that. Um, your favorite oh. drug dealer? Smoke some. Probably on disability. I don't wow. know for certain. Wow. But wow. I'm just, wow. it's a good chance. Yep. Your favorite drug dealer on disability. If you look at the statistics. If you look at them. Of drug dealers. Okay, but. This on disability. Tell them the part I like. Tell them what? The part I like. <laughs> Who coming for? I'm trying to tell them about the they statistics. They on disability. Po niggas. Po niggas all. All. They ain't even okay. po though. Oh. Motherfuckers be getting a pretty handsome goddamn profit <laughs> just, off of the... I'm just saying. I just tried to cover they... Oh, come on. They ain't trying to cover it. They ain't spending my tax money on, on goddamn got cocaine. The, yeah, that car videos. they got put up <laughs> waiting for the <laughs> Black Arts <laughs> Festival to come back. <laughs> <laughs> He's paying Quavis notes on these rims and this motherfucker taking thirty percent of my, my motherfucker. Oh, don't worry, I'm gonna get a pay job next time. Seven thousand dollars, <laughs> motherfuckers. I just, I oh, just had order. I just had ordered me a new um, top. <laughs> if we be somewhere and like motherfucker walk past or something, you with your bitch? Yeah. Well, your bitch, look at me. And then your bitch smile at me. What's stop up, walking. Stop what you're doing. Stop it. Get off of the phone because you probably ain't even paying attention to what put your bitch your doing. Um, stop it. Put it in your Tell your bitch, say, hey, look at me. Look at me in my eyes. Tell your bitch, quit fucking smiling at me. I don't, I don't want that bitch. That bitch aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> smiling at me while she yeah, with you. Tell her, <laughs> stop. Tell her, stop. Tell her, fucking quit tell doing that shit. Tell her, don't be doing that shit, man. She and, did it too freely. I'm yeah, just saying, like, like don't it? shit. All right. I mean, is that your little brother or something? Goddamn, what the fuck y'all doing? Maybe y'all ain't. Yeah, maybe y'all ain't really together. Um, you might feel played in that situation. Yeah. If you ever in a situation yeah, you feel don't. played, you don't really know what the fuck to do. Boosie said, "Said it all." I say, "Air yeah, that bitch out." Air yeah, that bitch yeah, out. Air that bitch out. Right Hello, no. Air yeah, that bitch. Do the Cyrus dogs? They coming to. <laughs> they coming to. Get up out of there. <laughs> Get up out of there. <laughs> but and that bitch out though. Shit. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm white Mike. Thank you, everybody. I'm, I'm white Mike got some too, though. Some closes? I just got one and I got to keep me one. Uh hey Kings, go out there and find you a teacher with an OnlyFans. Okay, okay then. Then. I can't say nothing. You bad might learn something. You might learn something. Yeah. Do that shit. <laughs> Teachers with OnlyFans. <laughs>